Elizabeth said, any issues you foresee with dating someone 12 years older? Fantastic communication. Can't imagine my life without him. No. <laughs> I mean, is that, are you saying that because you feel like that's really old? It, you know, it kind of depends. There's different cultures out there, right? Like American culture for a long time had this thing where everybody was like, if you're more than like five years difference in age, everybody was weird about it. Like that was a thing for a long time in American culture. And American culture has kind of opened up a lot more now and you're starting to see relationships with people that are 10, 20, 30, 40 years difference in part because people are starting to feel like it's okay for them to act on whatever they're actually interested in. And a lot of times people are actually interested in all kinds of different things. And so you, you should just do whatever works for you. Just find what works for you. And if it's a good situation, it's a good situation. If it, if it's something that, that is amazing for you, you, you know, you're talking about, you can't imagine your life without them. That sounds great. I mean, why, uh, uh, could there be any issues with it? There could always be issues with it, right? He's 12 years older than you. So that means that, you know, women, live longer than men, which means that at some point he's going to die and it's probably going to be a lot sooner than you. And so that could be a problem, right? Uh, there could be other problems, but those are just normal, regular problems. There could be problems with ED and other factors like that. And so, yeah, I mean, there, there are a lot of different problems that could come up around dating somebody that's a lot older than you. However, if it works for you and you guys are totally in love with each other and it really works great. By all means, do it. 